Welcome to Lake Livingston Village. We're about to pass the main office. Beautiful main office. Grounds are well kept. They often hold barbecues here for the subdivision. And uh, right underneath that cabana, there's two double doors. And uh, they're open six days a week. The number is 936-566-4272. This is definitely a family atmosphere type subdivision. Everybody's happy that buys into here. Everybody is. And these lots are getting harder to find, so definitely uh, give us a call. Welcome to thelandmaster.com. The, today is an absolutely beautiful day. The winter is setting in. The fall is here. There's no mosquitoes out. Uh, this is, there's no better time of the year to sell a beautiful lot that you can put a travel trailer on. Right now, the holiday season's approaching, so we're selling everything at a discounted rate. These prices are not going to stay after the New Year's. We do this every year, so it's a great opportunity for somebody out there who wants to get a property, put an RV on, or a travel trailer. This lot here is lot number 260 of Lake Livingston Village. Lake Livingston Village is the best subdivision in the entire area. It's the only subdivision that you can put a travel trailer on, and it also has city utilities, uh, city water, and city sewage all at the road. This property has got a perfect location. The neighbor is retired right next to me, neat and clean. We've never even seen him. This lot is easy clearing. I can't stress enough. There are some properties that we can't even breach the tree line. We can't walk onto the properties. Normally, those properties, you see the whole jungle effect with trees going everywhere and branches everywhere. Not this property. Uh, I'm going to walk this property with you. I'm going to show you that you could do this, and I think, in under a day. This saves you an average of three to $4,000 in hiring a clearing company. So you're already ahead of the game as far as development. Now, when it comes to developing the property, we have the man for you. We have the person all set up to come in and lay down a pad and culvert and do everything that you need to do. We can get that started tomorrow. Right now, this property is being advertised at $5,500. I can't stress to you how cheap this is. These lots normally sell between seven dollars and $8,000, but the new year is upon us. This is a blowout sale. So if you want a great property in a great location, you've come to the right place. Take a walk with me right now, and let me show you how easy this property is to clear. As you can see, I can walk on the property. Here's a path. Maybe it was cleared before. I don't know. Uh, but this is just amazing because I can do this myself in a day. Now, I'm 46 years old. I'm not young anymore. But I can do this myself in about a day. You know, I, I find this hard to believe that this space is right here. This property could have been cleared before in the past and the brush just grew up. And you are allowed to burn here. So you could do a nice little burn pile and get all this done in a day. And this is a great spot to put your trap trailer. This comes out easy. This will drop no problem. Uh, what's great is that this property is marked. There are boundary markers, everything, so it's easy to find the property. Uh, clear title, everything good to go. I don't know what else I can say, but I'm here on the center of the property. Uh, this is the perfect, perfect project lot. We got it all lined up for you. Uh, the development, everything is ready to go. You don't have to build in the slot. You can buy the slot today. Uh, you can use the full service RV spots in the subdivision if you can't get this lot developed. Yes. There's a spot in the subdivision. They got about four or five spots. You can use these spots, park your travel trailer there, and use your own subdivision until you get this lot done. It's not a problem. But you don't have to do anything to it. The association dues are $25 per month, and they cover trash pickup. That's really important. It costs more to have your trash picked up in this county than it does for these association dues. The average price in this county is $34 to pick up your garbage. There is no county garbage pickup. Everything is outsourced, not here. They pick it up for $25 a month. So I, I like to tell people it's just discounted garbage pickup, but it's actually your POA fees. 
$25 a month is cheap. The taxes on this property per year are about $40 per year. Your taxes do not go up if you have a travel trailer or an RV. So you can put an RV on this property, have a place to go to. It'll cost you $40 per year. And of course, the association dues, which come out to approximately $270 per year. Anyway, thank you very much for chiming in on the super property. I want to wish everyone out there a happy Thanksgiving. I'm very proud of the property. Call me or text me seven days a week. We are up till midnight. We're advertised all over the nation. 423 by land. Call me today. Thank you. Here is the back marker. It's the back corner marker. So there seems to be a lot between lot 260 and that house over there. There's a strip of land which gives you that privacy. So that's kind of nice right there. But there's the back lot marker. So it's 105 feet roughly all the way through the brush to the front of the road. Okay? So you've got 105 feet with a lot between that place and here. So you're always going to have those woods there for the most part. All right. So we're at the back corner lot line. As I spin around, we just sold this lot behind us to a gentleman named Richard. Great guy. Great guy. He's retired. No kids. He's in his 60s. Um, there is the other marker, which is approximately 40 feet wide. So from, from that marker... All the way to there is a back lot line, okay? Now, this lot was just finished, so it gives you an idea of how beautiful this property will look when it's finished. This property looked just like the one that we're selling in 260. It's right behind it. He, uh, our lot development uh, gentleman, his name is Dave. Uh, his number's on our webpage, and we'll forward the number to you. He brought the dirt in. He brought his tractor. He also just laid this rock pad, I believe, yesterday. This is brand new. So this gives you an idea what you can do with this. So here's the back corner lot line of 260. Okay, you can see it says uh, 260 right there. So we're going to walk down uh, 260, and we're going to walk to the actual front of the property. Um, pretty cool that I can walk through the property. Uh, I got to tell you, there are some lots that I actually clear myself. And when you start clearing the lot, you can't even break the, the tree line. When you, the rule of thumb is if you start a property with your chainsaw high in the air, that's not a good sign. That means you're cut. That means you're, you're loaded with vines. This is a, this is great. I may even clear the property. I don't know. Uh, but we want to keep the price low. I know that somebody can do this themselves. Okay. Uh, so as I'm walking through this property, you can see it's pretty simple here. Uh, nice tree here, oak tree, right? Um, this oak tree is not far from the lot line to the far right. So this brush right here, once it's taken down, will give you a nice clear path right about through here. And I would angle my unit probably back towards there. I don't know if you can tell, but let me see if I can show you the right about there's a pink marker right where my finger is kind of hard to see right, right about there, but that's your lot line. Okay. So as I'm walking out, oh man, the neighbor's nice, neat, clean, retired. I've never seen this person. I've been here so many times and uh, this is definitely a retirement area. Um, really, really, really important factor. When you buy these lots, the electric company, by the way, there's the other lot line from there to there. When you buy these lots, uh, the electric company will come out and do a site inspection and the cost for electricity can be brutal. They, uh, it can be as much as $3,000 to get a brand new pole and transformer. Pole will run you anywhere from twelve dollars to $1,500. Transformer can run you as much as seven dollars to $800. Hard to say. They won't even give you a price on the phone. However... When you have a pole on your lot line to a working transformer, you're golden. Uh, all you would have to do is uh, get a small electric pole on your lot and have the electric run. And I guesstimate that you know your pole will run you around 350 bucks if you run um, 
let's just say an extra four or five hundred for uh for cable so roughly eight hundred dollars uh to get electric finished done in uh, everything you need to do uh, saves you about two and a half thousand. So as I walk out to this property, there's your 40 foot line. It starts at the pole here. We have found the property markers. Actually, we had the, uh, so we from the POA find it for us. See, there's the marker. All four markers have been found. Oh man, great neighbor. Super clean. Super neighbor. You know, I love that American flag. Uh, being a veteran, I have great affection for neighbors that hang that flag proudly. It just looks so good. Uh, this gentleman has his property goes from the front road all the way to the back. Okay, so as I turn around, there's our property stakes from there to there. Okay, for two sixty. I'm not sure if somebody owns this lot. Uh, there's a good possibility that the neighbor does. I have not researched that, but it's great because you have a lot between 260 and the neighbor. You can see the opening we came out of, and just to give you a side profile, um, nobody's developed there. There is nobody on this side of the street. Uh, there are a couple of residents, a couple hundred feet away quiet neighborhood man you just can't beat it beautiful street perfect 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 and of course look don't kid yourself that is priceless notice there's not one here uh, they have a transformer there they have a transformer there notice on this side of the street there's no poles going down here Anybody that buys here is going to get punched in the face for $3,000. Anybody is. Not a lot that I'm selling. Okay, that's the joy of, uh, of buying from somebody like me. I know what I'm doing. Uh, and I, when I buy my properties, I have to calculate that. And I make sure that it's advantageous for you. You know, sometimes I have to. You know, sometimes I don't have a choice. These properties are becoming harder to find. Uh, but whenever I get a property with the transformer and pull right at the corner, oh, I'm winning. Uh, 423 Buy Land, uh, call me today. It's been uh, a pleasure. The weather is fantastic, and uh, I think you guys will be happy with this. Take care. Happy Thanksgiving. Here is the designated spot in the subdivision for lot owners with RV hookups and a little swimming pool and some cute little cabins. Uh, for a very minimal fee, you can talk to Karen at the front desk and she will um, work something out with you. You can stay here with your RV. And here's, there's one person already. This place is never full up. There's always available spots. So you can see this person is in an RV. They're a lot owner. Maybe they're developing their lot. Maybe they're waiting. Maybe they're working on it. Who knows? Really cute little park. I wanted to show this to everybody because this is a this is an asset. I had a customer develop a lot once, and he utilized uh, this RV section while he developed his lot, and it worked out really nicely. He stayed here a couple of weeks. You've got some picnic tables there. You've got a small swimming pool, I believe. The maintenance crew does a super job at maintaining these areas in the subdivision. Really cute. To my left, right here, you can see some empty RV spots not being used. A picnic table, a little charcoal grill. You can see the uh, electrical hookups right there. Real quiet. That's what I love about the subdivision. Really peaceful. Over here, you've got one, two, three, four cabins. You can rent those cabins by the night if you don't have an RV. I mean, they're real basic. You can see, you can see they do have uh, two air conditioning units. You may have to bring your own bedding. It's not a hotel, but really uh, 
really nice to have. There's no other subdivision that has these attributes. And of course, there's even a swimming pool, especially when it's hot out. So, um, this is just a little quick snapshot of the RV spots. Really handy. Now, onto the uh, boat ramp. Okay, here we are at the designated boat ramp section for all lot owners. And uh, you can get a key as a lot owner. Just go to the front office. They're constantly maintaining this subdivision so nothing uh, is left to be fixed. Here's where you will back your boat in. Probably the most important aspect is that pink little building right there. <laughs> it's nice to have a bathroom facility by the boat ramp. Because if you're on a boat, you don't have to go home to uh, well, take care of things. All of this land belongs to the boat ramp section. So it's a great little park area to take your dog. We take our dog here occasionally. We have him with us today. And it's a great little uh, fishing spot. There's a gentleman in the far corner. He's fishing. I don't think we're going to bother him too much. Uh, this lake is the most beautiful lake you've ever seen. Um, it has more coastline than the state of Maine. From what we've been told and what we've read over the years. I don't know who actually walked the coastline, but... Here, we'll go to this side. Really nice. It's a beautiful morning. It's 8.15 in the morning. And it's, it must be about 82 degrees. It's not too hot. And you can see the open water. It's about 300 feet away from here. There's the open water. You don't have to take your boat through uh, canal channels to get to the open water. That is really, really important. There's some subdivisions that you'd have to go a mile or two in order to get out into the lake. And then, of course, you're hitting low spots. Not here. It's got beautiful uh, depth here. You could back in a large boat. And, of course, uh, you can fish here, too. A lot of catfish tend to group in this corner here, from what people tell me. And, um, but, and these are uh, really beautiful waterfront houses on either side that you're looking at in front. And there you go. There's a little barbecue there. You can picnic here if you'd like. But, uh, well, this is a wrap, so I'm going to let you guys go. Thank you very much for the time you spent in giving us the opportunity to sell our lots to you. We thank you kindly. Call or text us seven days a week at 423 Buy Land. Entering uh, Lake Livingston Village. This is the entrance for sections 7 through 14. As you can see, the subdivision is well taken care of. They have their own maintenance crew. And uh, they do everything. 